Guys, what's up? Cryptic here. Welcome to a new series for Seven Days to Die. Yes, I have succumbed to playing a modded version of Seven Days to Die, going with Darkness Falls, and I can honestly tell you I'm nervous about this one. So I've only watched people play it on YouTube. I've seen Skippy, Ja Woodle, Mr. Spartan, and Games for Kicks, a couple other people, but I know how crazy this game can get. I can tell you now it's not permadeath because it's not going to be permadeath for me. Uh, but let's start a new game. I normally always play on time 64 zombies, but I've seen how crazy these horde knights get. So I'm going to leave it at 32 or 16. I'm just gonna be a little bit more cautious, right? So who do we want to play, huh? Who do we who do we want to be today? Uh, I really don't care who it is, cause they're all gonna die. Doesn't matter who it is. Well, let's play uh, let's play Emma because she almost looks like she's dead. All right, so let's go ahead and play Emma. Name for new profile. Dude, I'm really nervous about this one. Oh, we can play a dude? Alright, well, I don't care about the hairstyle and shit. Let's randomize him. God damn. There we go. You can have a zombie eat your beard. Alright, what do we do? Is already broken? Oh, I'm broken. That actually used to be a character name I had in World of Warcraft, I'm broken. Now I heard we can't use a nitrogen map, so we have to use a Darkness Falls map, I guess. So let's just go with the XL2. And let's just say, uh, darkness will kill me. There we go. Darkness will kill me. All right. We're going to do, uh, what's this? Max Zombies Alive 75. Wow. We can do 200. Um, well, shit. We better just start at 75, um, to be safe. Basic. Uh, let's just start on adventure on the default. Uh, blood mood frequency, seven days. Um, zero days, I guess. Make it all uh, back to normal for that kind of stuff. Zombie day will be uh, the walk, everything will be there. XP multiplier will knock it down to default. So, what's default for zombies alive? There is no default, 75 is the lowest, so we'll just go to 100. We'll go 80 animals, because why not? Loose respawn time disabled. I'm gonna leave that disabled, guys, because I really don't like the loot to respawn. I don't like to drop my stuff on death. The blood moon count. Uh, let's go 32. I don't want to die my first toward night. Air drops every day. I like to leave them marked on. All right, guys. Let's see what kind of nightmares we can spawn in Darkness Falls. Like I said, I'm actually really nervous about this mod. I'm not that good of a player to begin with, so... We shall see how fast I die. As most of you know, day three is my death day, right? I always die on day three by a, a dog. A dog always kills me on day three. 
So if I can make it past day three, then past the first four tonight will be good. I hope. I doubt it. Probably not. Probably gonna die every day. And if the first Horde Knight's not too bad, I'm gonna pump that shit up to 64, and that zombie thing I made at 100, I'll pump that thing up to 200. Be like Dawn of the Dead. I wish somebody out there would make a mod for this game, but instead of zombies, like the Exomorph Aliens off the movie Alien, pretty badass, man. But one thing I do know about this game, thanks John Whittle, don't get bit by a spider, bro, because you'll die. And then you'll have a heart attack and you'll die. So I know that much. All right, guys, we're finally in. So excuse me as I actually read what's going on instead of just clicking the yes, continue, and okay buttons like I normally do in Windows. Use this item to craft a starter item for your class when you wish to use it. I guess I'll use it now. So we pick a class. Now, how do you, what, what's the best class? I don't know. So let's say right now, what I do for work is construction, right? So I'm a laborer. Okay, so I do labor work, right? But I've also been in security. So I'm a laborer, but I own my own business. So I'm going to go to my previous job, and that's how I'm going to pick my class. So we're going to do security because that's what I used to do. Okay. Okay. Put it in the hot bar because I think that's where you got. I remember watching Jaw Woodle, that's where you got to use it. You were either in the police force or the army before the world went to shit. What's new? Knowing how to defend yourself against people is going to be handy with all the bandits and zombies around. Okay. So I got a pig there. So what do we do? Do we save these books for later? Is that what we do? I don't know. I don't know if that's what we do or not. Okay, so I got an axe. What can we craft? Any tools? So it just says locate a trader. So how do you make a perimeter about wood and plant fibers? I think you want to get some of this stuff here. We want to get some rocks. We got to make our standard bow. But let's go ahead and work our way to the trader while we figure out. Do we have clothes on or are we naked? So we're naked. So we got to build some clothes. Okay. All right. All right. Well, let's go ahead and... Uh, There's a lot of vegetables around here. Freaking lot of zombies. It's pretty badass actually with all the zombies. We definitely don't want to get caught outside at nighttime. Big mama. Pretty encumbered. Is that a survivor? Oh, shoot. Nice. Give me anything good, buddy? Oh, yeah, a pipe rifle. Hells, yeah. And he gave me nine ammo for it. All right.
Look at this nitrate here. I'm getting some nitrate anyways. Oh, look, there's a cow. He's walking pretty darn fast for being a freaking new zombie. I wonder if food is as important in this game as Well, I just wasted that, but that's okay. Gut punch you bitch. That's right. Nice position right there. It's how you belong. Ooh, hey cow. Let's get out of the way. Damn. It's laggy. I got some clothes I didn't know I had. What you gave me, buddy? Some lead, I'll just throw it out for now. Look, I got these. I wonder if these came out of my backpack. I just didn't notice it. Probably. Like I said, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm pretty new. I'm a very new. Actually, I've never played before, so. I don't know why I'm even collecting arrows. I'm not much of a arrow person. I don't use the bow very often. Come here, buddy. Oh, you want to play too, honey? Hey. She dead. There's a vending machine. Let's see if it works. It does. Oh, it's broken. All right. We well, found five dupe coins. It was worth checking. Got glue. I'm a scavenger, guys. I love to loot. So if you don't like to watch looting, you probably won't like to watch this series. Uh, but I also like to build to the best of my ability. You know, I'm not a ja Woodle or a Skippy. Those guys can build like those and Grand Spartan. Man, I can't build as good as those guys. Don't have the imagination, I guess. But I can actually I can rebuild stuff pretty good. We're doing a, a apartment rebuild in my No Traders series where we're not allowed to use the traders. It's random horde nights, so it's pretty cool. Well, for me it is. It's, I enjoy building more. As much as I enjoy looting. So how do you f repair this? So you go here. Okay. I definitely got to learn this game because it is way different than vanilla.
Yeah, we can. So I know there's a dog in here, right? Because one of my original series, the fucking dog killed me. Came running out. Bit me, bit me in the balls and I died. So I know that he's in there. Let's see if we can axe this bitch. Jason Forehead, motherfucker. Uno. Dos. Konnichiwa. See ya. Oh, hey. You wanna... Here, let me hit you with the wood right there in your butt. Okay. That guy got pissed. He's like, yo, that's my girlfriend, bitch. You just hit my girlfriend in her butt with your wood club. Yeah, but she liked it. Okay. Enough playing around. Let's reset this. Let's set this quest. Let's uh, build a little uh, storage chest out here where we can put some of this stuff. I don't know how far out the perimeter goes. Never really paid attention when uh, other players do it. So... I guess I don't need that axe because I have an 11, level 11 axe. Man, let's just mark it here so we don't forget. Because I'll forget if I leave it. And then let's go here and put here trader. I think we're going to probably live at the trader. I mean, I'm not opposed to it. And just temporarily until we get our bearings in the game. All right, guys, let's go in there. I'm not sure how to get in there, but I'm gonna pull this gun. Can we make frames? And I'm not gonna waste my ammo on zombies when really I need to waste it on the dog. And grab this torch. I think we can use that later. I got it. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm not gonna fuck around in here. I already know there's a dog and that dog kills me on day three. What's this? Flower. Wow. That's pretty fucking cool. I'm digging this mod already. I mean, like I said, I've already watched other players play, so. Like, she was right there behind me. She almost got me. Well, let's grab all of our stuff. We'll just be encumbered. I probably don't need the axe, and if I do, I can make us another one, right? Well, let's go kill her. Hey, baby. Sorry, sorry I forgot my wallet when we were out on our date. Nurse Nancy. I got... Rose. Let's just so up the seven days to die. God's blessed me with lots and lots of ammo. But I'll still make the arrows because during Horde Night, we're going to need them. Oh, wow. Okay. Pretty glitchy, though. And I, I don't know if it's glitchy because the zombies are spawning in. I'm pretty sure that's why it's stopping like this I think if we did 200 zombies that would push this computer to the max I gotta be careful for the dog we could always use see there's probably a dog back here this is always a potential house too there's you know, it's close to the trader there's already a wall up house is pretty beat up we could fix it up make it one of our goals bulletproof glass we'll look and see not something that we're gonna look at right now if we make it past the first horde night then we'll consider doing that guys
take a gander around the trader, see what there is. I picked up some cotton, which I don't need. Get out of here with that cotton shit. Stuff. Sorry. This is not a kid channel. Not kid friendly, by the way. So, if you haven't noticed, my channel's not kid friendly. Sorry, kids. I don't want your mom getting pissed off if you, if you learn some words that you shouldn't be learning yet. All right, guys, let's head into the trader. Let's uh, get these uh, turned in. Let's clean up the scrap trash. Get some plastic out of that deal. Get rid of these. This is a, a no loot respawn game. Okay, so loot will not respawn in this series. Smells like dysentery. So, I want the 762 ammo, of course. Clear zombies, fetch buried supplies. Let's do a buried supply. The crickets are out. Do you have to read this in the hot bar? I think you do, don't you? Hey, dirt bag. What the fuck? Call me a dirt bag. You don't even know me. That's. Standard on YouTube, right guys? Get called a dirt bag and they don't even know you. Alright. Let's see if we can make arrows. Wait, we need to make sharp rocks, right? So let's see here. So I don't want to make that many, so we'll make 35 sharp rocks. So far, so good on the first start of Darkness Falls. Um, I already knew I already knew I'd enjoy the the mod because I've watched enough people play it, but I haven't watched enough people like really pay attention to how to play the game. If you know what I mean, like actually watching the game. So I need to probably go through and and do that at some point to actually watch it. Got to build a shovel. And I need to work on our stamina. The one axe in that I had, I think it was actually different thinking about it. Potato. So everything's about two. Cat food. Shit's bad for you. Holy crap. 20% food poisoning on the canned soup. That's at least it's realistic. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for today's episode. I'm pretty sure it's getting close to nighttime outside. And uh, I know better than to be outside in the dark. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to squat here on the toilet and try to hide. And I'm going to read what we need to do. So, guys, hope you're looking forward to this series. I know I am. I'm excited to play Darkness Falls along with my No Trader series and my House Flippers series. So, guys, thanks for watching. Sorry about that. Hit the mic. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like. Uh, leave comments to help me with this game because I have no freaking clue how to play it. So, if you can do that, I'd appreciate it. And, as always... I'll see you on the next one. Peace.